our next guest will still be Big Ben's main receiver. We welcome in Oprah Voice, Emmanuel Sanders. that he was saying that whatever it is that you do is it the Steelers way. Hey, I, I love the Pittsburgh Steelers. Uh, I want to be a Pittsburgh Steeler. I'm happy that I'm continuing. I'm still a Pittsburgh Steeler. Hopefully we can work out a long-term deal and I can be a Steeler my entire career. But guess what? I'm passionate about it too. I I'm ticked off that we went eight and eight last year and it's not gonna happen again. We're <laughs> happy about that. Yeah, yeah, I'm go. happy about it. I just said a first take, man, Matt, Stephen A, Kerry, and uh, uh, Skip Bayless. Uh, had a good time, man. Uh, lobby for the White Howard to the Houston Rockets. Hopefully, the White Lessons, man. Let's get it. Now we're about to walk to the Sports Center and uh, go on live here. Yeah, from Belleville, Texas, by way of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Emmanuel Sanders, Pittsburgh Steelers wideout, joining us on SportsCenter. Uh, the expectations in, in Pittsburgh is, is a Lombardi trophy. It's every year, uh, we prepare ourselves to uh, make it to the Super Bowl and win the Super Bowl. And uh, we're working extremely hard every single day. As you understand it right now, what is your role on the team this season? All right now, uh, I'm going to step into the uh, Mike's role. Ever since I, I came into this league, I wanted to be a starter. I wanted to uh, get those targets. So uh, now the moment is here. So carpe diem. I was a rookie. Uh, I was telling myself, I just I want to be in the Super Bowl. But I wasn't thinking from the standpoint of I want to win the Super Bowl. Mm. And now that I've been to the Super Bowl, I'm thinking from the standpoint of I want to win the Super Bowl. And I take, for me personally, I, I made it to the Super Bowl. I was the number three receiver and broke my foot in the Super Bowl. So I have a lot of pain when it comes to the Super Bowl. So it's one of those things that I want to get back to and I want to win it all. We're just talking off air about your off season. You, uh, you became the, the the prettiest bell at the ball, so to speak, man. You had a great opportunity. New England is flirting with you. Yeah. And then you got Ben Roethlisberger stepping up to bat saying, we're not losing this guy. What did it mean for you? Oh, it definitely felt good uh, to have your quarterback uh, come to bat for you, have your back, saying that I don't want to lose this guy. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, he said on air that, you know, he thinks I could come in and be a great player. Um, and, 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 you know, it's good. It's good to be wanted, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, the Steelers. Uh, they waited the whole five-day grace period. On that Sunday, the deadline was at 12 uh, that night, and they called me at 6 o'clock. So I had my mind made up that I was going to New England. Right. Like, Tommy called me and said, uh, we're going to match the tender. We appreciate your time. Hey, Congratulations on everything. When they made the offer sheet for the Patriots, what did you think was going to happen? Uh, no expectations. Um, you know, I was in a win-win situation. You got... Uh, New England Patriots, you got Pittsburgh Steelers, you got Tom Brady, you got Ben Roethlisberger. So I just told myself to sit back, relax. You have five days. Uh, the Pittsburgh, Pittsburgh had to make a decision. So I just worked out extremely hard every day and let the chips fall where they may. Emmanuel, my father has a question for you. Go ahead, Poppy. Can you give me a tip on how to win a fight? A tip how to win a fight? <laughs> go, go and tell a man surrenders. <laughs> <laughs> just Don't ever give up. <laughs> just keep, keep, just keep going, man. They, they told me, uh, no matter what, uh, you can, you can judge, you can, uh, you can measure a man's hands, you can measure a man's feet, but you can't measure a man's heart. So always have a lot of heart and continue to go, continue to go until he surrenders. Emmanuel, thank you so much for being on with us. We really enjoyed your time. Yes, sir. Thanks for having me. Gracias.